Hey what's up everybody, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to launch apps and custom actions with weight gestures. Now I'm sure you've heard of double tap to wake, right? Well what if you could double tap your screen while your phone's asleep to launch a specific app directly? That's the premise behind developer Vlar 2's latest app, Wake Gestures. It lets you launch any app, activity, or shortcut by simply performing a gesture, even when the screen is off. To get this one going, you'll need to be rooted with a custom kernel installed, but the kernel has to specifically support wake gestures, and for the most part that means you'll need Elemental X. But we've got a really easy guide that you can use to install Elemental X over at the full tutorial for this one, so head to the link in the description below to get that part sorted out, and as an addendum, I'd recommend that you enable as many wake gestures as possible during kernel setup. Now let's say you have Elemental X installed already, and you've enabled double tap to wake, slide to wake, and really every gesture it offers. Well, the next step is to grab a copy of Flar 2's Wake Gestures app. This is another thing that you can grab from the full tutorial, so once you've got the APK saved to your device, go ahead and tap the Download Complete Notification. From here, press Install, then when that's finished, tap Open. Right off the bat, Wake Gestures will ask for super user access, so tap Grant on this pop-up. From here, it's a pretty intuitive interface. Any gestures that you enable during kernel setup will be listed as options. So let's take Double Tap, for instance. Instead of just waking the device, I want this gesture to launch an app directly. When you select it, you'll see a few actions that are available for this gesture to perform. You can have it turn the screen on like normal, or you can have it toggle the flashlight, for instance. But if you hit this drop menu, you get even more options. Shortcuts will get you access to stuff like bookmarks, or direct dialing a contact, for example. Then of course if you select applications instead, you'll see a list of all your installed apps. Just to give you a demo, I'm going to have the double tap gesture open Chrome directly. But you can do this with all of the weight gestures that you enable during kernel setup, so there's tons of options. Then beneath all the gestures, you'll find some extra settings. You can use these to do stuff like prevent the gestures from activating when your phone is in your pocket, or have the power button serve as a manual override of sorts. By default, it bypasses the lock screen when you perform one of these gestures, and I certainly recommend leaving that one set as it is. But you can also control haptic feedback and set a weight gesture timeout, so there's plenty of customization options here. In the end though, it's all about the gestures, so let's see one of those in action. Now pretend I just pulled my phone out of my pocket and I want to go directly to Chrome and browse the internet. All I have to do is double tap the screen, and Chrome comes up immediately. Awesome, right? But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.